Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this video, we will discuss what are the analog modules and what are the analog input modules. First of all, we will discuss analog modules and then we will briefly and in detail discuss the analog input modules. When you automate process, you will frequently need to acquire or control analog values such as temperatures, pressures and filling levels. Without additional modules, the base unit of the Melsic FX family can only process digital input and output signals that is on and off data. Additional analog modules are thus required for inputting and outputting analog signals. Basically, there are two different kinds of analog modules, analog input modules and analog output modules. Analog output, analog input modules can acquire current, voltage and temperature values. Analog output modules send current or voltage signals to the modules output. In addition to this, there are also combination modules which can both acquire and output analog signals. It means that the analog input modules can process three kinds of values, voltage, current and temperature and the analog output modules can process only two values that is current and voltages. Analog input modules. Analog input modules convert a measured analog value that is 10 volt into a digital value that is 4000 that can be processed by the PLC. This conversion process is known as analog to digital conversion or AID conversion for short. Temperatures can be acquired directly by the analog modules of the Melsic FX family but other physical values like pressures or flow rates must first be converted into the current or voltage values before they can be converted into the digital values for processing by the PLC. This conversion is performed by the sensors that output signals in standardized ranges that is 0 to 10 volt or 4 to 20 milliampere. The measurement of current signal has the advantage that the value is not falsified by the length of the cables or contact resistances. It means that the current signal is not falsified by the length of the cable. The following example of the analog value acquisition shows a flow measurement solution with a PLC of the Melsic FX3U series. Flow measurement device with voltage or current output. For example, this is a flow device and here is a sensor which converts this flow into the voltage or current for example and this voltage is and current is transferred then to the analog input module which converts into the digital value because PLC reads only the digital value. So first we will convert this signal into the digital value. This digital value for example 2000 value is, is obtained from this uh, analog signal which will be then sent to the base unit of the FX3U series Mitsubishi PLC series. So this is the process. It means that the analog input modules are used to convert the analog values to the digital values which will be understandable by the PLCs. And at the in, and the input modules read three types of values current voltage and temperature the output module module read only two types of value that is that is uh, current and voltage so this is the brief description of the analog input module used in the mitsubishi plc series thank you so much for watching this video